Kara Kapetsky's ex-boyfriend is in trouble with the law once again. This time, it's theft, the third charge in three weeks, uncovered by our investigator, Russ Patasi. According to this probable cause statement, the theft inside this tattoo shop occurred before the July assault on his current girlfriend and the new charges of animal abuse. This tattoo gun is similar to three tattoo guns 23-year-old Kyler used is accused of stealing from Lucky Lady Tattoo on Warnell, where Eust had been a tattoo apprentice. The shop's owner says the tattoos around Eust's neck, seen here when he was arrested last month for allegedly killing three kittens, were tattooed inside this tattoo parlor. One of the missing tattoo guns was designed to look like a Batman logo. According to court documents, Eust admitted to taking the Batman tattoo machine and other property from the business, but stated that the property belonged to him. In 2007, days before her disappearance, Kara Kapetsky filed a restraining order against Eust, claiming he choked her, kidnapped her, and threatened to slit her throat. And just last month, Eust pleaded guilty to choking his then-girlfriend in July of this year. She told police he told her during the attack he'd killed ex-girlfriends out of sheer jealousy. Prosecutors say they agreed to drop the tattoo shop theft charge in a diversion deal, but that all changed when Eust was arrested for that domestic assault. Eust is scheduled for an October 13th hearing in connection to the theft from this tattoo parlor. The next day, October 14th, he's scheduled for court on those animal abuse cases in connection with allegations he killed kittens. Near 83rd and Warnell, Russ Potosik, NBC Action News.